My Carvin DC800 is equipped now with two EMG40 DCX pickups, as well as Graftech Ghost saddles. I have eight of those. I sum this together to act as a single pickup because I don't really have need of using the individual outputs, I don't think. Uh, so what I want to do, I, uh, first of all, I took off all the controls. I don't use a three-way switch here or any volume or tone. I do all that in software. But what I need to do in order to get good signals into my software is to get uh, the individual unprocessed outputs of each pickup. So we'll consider this three pickups. We'll start off with... Uh, this. I have two jacks here. So we're going to use the one that's closer to the strap button. It could be either way, however you want to wire it up. But I have it so that if you plug in a mono cable into the jack closer to the strap button, you now have on the tip of that cable this bridge EMG. And then, if we use a stereo cable, we're going to have the bridge on the tip, the neck pickup on the ring. And then, if we want to have the output of the ghost saddles, we can add into that another mono cable. So now we have stereo signal on here, and then mono signal there because we only have a total of three outputs. That's all good. And then, if I want to, I can then use a TRS cable in the other jack, the one that we previously had the ghost on. So we plug in a stereo cable there with nothing in the other one. And now we get the ghost pickups on the tip of the cable. But then we uh, get the neck pickup on the ring of that cable. So. If you just have a stereo cable, you just you choose what two pickups you want to use. The neck is going to be on the ring in either case. But here we're going to have uh, this bridge, and then there we're going to have that bridge. Magnetic or piezo. And then finally, if we want to get this is uh, using one a single cable. If we wanted to have the output of both bridges for some reason could then use a splitter the other way. So it doesn't matter which one we use, but we're gonna have two mono signals. We're gonna have one coming out of here and one coming out of there. And so now along this cable, we're going to have uh, both this bridge, piezo bridge, and the magnetic bridge, and then we split that as we want to. So what's good about this setup is that we have that flexibility to have um, the signals, it's easy to get the, the neck and one of the bridges on a single cable, and if we need to have all three, we can. And what else is good is we have the battery only turning, uh, only powering the EMGs when something is plugged in, and in any case, we have a single ground. So I like the current setup, it's simple, and controls on the instrument would only complicate things, I think, but there are a couple problems a few problems, and if you can improve my wiring, wiring method so at least one of the problems is solved, I'd love to hear about it. So here's the problems. One is, if we are to use a single mono cable, if we, let's say we just want to have the output of the ghost. Well, unfortunately, that, that's going to work out, but now we're also, because something is plugged in, anytime anything is plugged in, we're going to be powering the magnetic pickups. It's not a big deal. The batteries will last a long time. And also, I do have this battery holder. I could just take that out. And even though I have another battery in the cavity, so I have an 18-volt uh, setup, I could, I, I mean, I could break this. This doesn't go to 9 volts or something now. It just totally breaks the circuit. The EMGs aren't being powered. But I'd like to not be not have to do that. So if you could find out a better way to wire things that would take care of that and not ruin anything else that I talked about already, that would be cool. And also, if we have a TRS cable plugged into each jack, there's not going to be anything on the ring of this lower jack where the piezo is on the tip, the ghost are on the tip. There won't be anything on the on the ring whether it's a stereo cable or a mono cable. So it, if you could put something there, that would be cool. Um, yeah, so anytime anything is plugged in, I think I talked about that, anything, anytime anything is plugged in, 
the pickups are receiving power. The one that matters is plugging into this jack with a mono cable. All right, thanks for your help in advance.